In this video I'm going to be exploring the source of a transmission fluid leak on a 2006 Chevrolet Impala with a 3.9 liter V6 motor. Alright, I'm underneath the driver's side of the car. You can see the uh, transmission pan and the uh, transmission cooler lines here. The uh, car has been leaking transmission fluid and I'm trying to locate where the leak is coming from and I've taken a look at the line and the line doesn't appear to be damaged or anything but the fitting that this is going into, it's got this little pl uh, black plastic cap, take that off and the oil seems to be coming down out of here and accumulates right here and drips so the fitting is actually bolted into the bottom of the transmission and this line there's only a little snap clip like a C clip that's holding it in um, so it's kind of loose uh, just anyway these are just kind of loose lines. I'm going to take this clip out I'm going to pull the line out and I'm going to inspect this uh, fitting here and see what's going on with uh, maybe an o-ring's going bad or something that's causing it to, to drip. I was thinking that maybe I'd have to replace this whole line and um, I don't know that I'm going to have to. I think maybe just this fitting is what's the culprit here. Alright, we've got the clip out. This is what it looks like. So I've got a catch pan here. I'm going to pull this line out and catch any of the fluid that drops out of here. I think what I'm going to do next is take this fitting off and uh, take a closer look at it and see what might be the problem with it leaking. I got a package of replacement O-rings that I bought a while back and just see if replacing this O-ring will do anything. Just see if I can find one that's that size. went to gmpartsgiant.com and got part number 2423655 and uh, we'll put this one on and fix our uh, transmission line leak. All right, comparing the two fittings, see the original one that was on the car, it's much longer. The threads are, are pretty much the same. It just stops short there and this one keeps going. I don't understand. Tighten that down snug, but not uh, not too tight. It's just an aluminum fitting. I still have the clip in there. I haven't taken that out. What I'm going to do is slide this in. It should just click in. Okay. And we'll just see if this baby stops leaking. I'm going to take a rag and I'm going to clean all this up. and uh, That way it's nice and dry and uh, be able to check for leaks. Well, we got the transmission fluid leak fixed on this vehicle and it ended up being just that small little fitting on the end of the transmission oil cooler line. The dealership uh, quoted the owner of this vehicle a couple hundred dollars to replace the lines themselves. It only ended up being just the fitting. So going to gmpartsgiant.com, I got a new fitting for less than $10. So it ended up being a very inexpensive fix and a pretty easy fix. Thanks for watching. God bless.